Hi, this is EuroJPY and today it's Sunday 13th of April 2014 and we are looking at the age 4 time frame of the pair before the markets open for the new trading week. I'm using Ichimoku Kinko Hill, Bollinger Bands, Fractals and Stochastics. We see that uh, we had given a buy signal a few days ago um, at the level where the price started fluctuating uh, up and down from. But let's go and look at the, at the bigger picture. Um, I will take this text from here and we'll see that we had a bullish price and consent cross on the weekly time frame. The price crossed and closed the bomb ten consent. It's a Moku Kikohio red line. And we also had the down fractal below the median Bolger band, which means that and, and, and the Bolger bands are in a contraction. Bollinger Bands being in a contraction, uh, we expect an expansion, a boom. And since we had this bullish price and consent cross on the weekly time frame, although price balances on the median Bollinger Band yet, we should normally expect a bullish move, an upward move. And since we already uh, saw on the clone pair of USDJPY uh, that it wants to go up after a deep correction, we expect to see something similar here too. Let's go back to the H4 time frame. From the H4 time frame, although this stochastic is going up, we didn't have a strong bullish price and consent cross unless we see a big bullish candlestick uh, uh, with the opening of the markets today. On the H1 time frame things are more clear and we see that the price goes clearly up above ten consent. All those stochastics show a temporary corrective mood but uh, Kumo is horizontal, we had these fluctuations, these ups and downs, th this ranging uh, mood of the pair and we should expect a strong bullish Kumo breakout on H1 and that will signal the, the, the beginning of a very strong bullish reversal. So um, things look uh, quite bullish but we must be a bit patient for the pair to to um, gather steam and go upwards. Thanks for watching and happy pips.